Good evening, sports fans and construction dorks. Um, so I've wanted to do one of these for a while, and I've always been curious on AI. And obviously, there's a lot of hype in construction, and there's some good software out there already that uses it, like SmartFit.io. Hence, why I'm wearing this hat. It's not not paid at all. Um, I just like Josh, I think it's cool. Tell him he's got a pretty face, and he gives you a hat at conferences. Um, and I've been long thinking about AI in construction, specifically on photos. Took a few photos off my phone, and uh, these are of us. Well, uh, not us. Um, we patched in um, some AVB details for... Um, we cut some ties, or we cut some poles in the building for ties for move, 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 move a bull scaffolding, um, uh, like this. So we had, this is, we had movable, movable, God, movable scaffolding, and we had ties in the building like this, and there's some there, and there's some here, and some here. And when we went to patch them back in, you know, we kind of took photos because it's what you have to do in 2019 to prove they did something right. You gotta take photos of it. And this photo isn't really meant for AI specifically, but it was a bigger point that I've always wondered is like, how does, how does, how will AI work with very like niche photos like this? Like I was scrolling through my phone and found some photos of um, like masonry flashing uh, uh, up a wall. And I've always wondered from like, I'm not, not necessarily, not necessarily a QA, QC standpoint, but like just a general overall, like, what is this? And like, does this match detail? Like all this like stuff that I've just long thought about is like, how is this gonna, gonna actually work? And I don't really have an answer. And I mean, and I'm curious what people think specifically. And don't just tell me we need more data. Like, and we're gonna train AI based on the more data. Like. I understand that that is a viable route, and that is one of the reasons why I think that a construction company could honestly take, if they paid someone, it could be an intern, to sit down and go through all of their photos of all of their job sites. They could probably train some pretty epic AI. It's a big, it's a hypothesis of mine um, that I think a construction company could do because for any startup to have photos of stuff like this, you're just not going to get that. You're not going to find this on Google. I'm going to have to Google it right now. Um, see, oh, let's see here. Oh, no. You get, what is this? You get pizza? I just ate this pizza. It's on Reddit. That's why you get that. There's no like AVB details. Like this is a, this is a sketch. This is a sketch. Table, sketch, 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 table. I don't know what this even is. No, 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 no. Pizza. I mean, I mean, I can, oh, well, we can go. I mean, you don't get any photos of stuff like that. Like, you're not going to, I mean, here's Den gla Den's glass that hasn't been sprayed yet. But you're not going to find, like, photos like this. Oops. You're not going to get photos like this without being in construction and seeing this on a daily basis and, like, taking photos of it. You're just not going to get that from from sucking stuff off the Internet and Google. Like, there's just not that many photos of it uploaded. It's a huge hypothesis of mine, but anyway, I'm, I'm going down the rabbit hole. I'm just curious, like... Do you agree with me? Do you not agree with me? Uh, if you agree with me, great. You don't need to make my ego bigger. But if you don't agree with me, I want to know why. And I also want to know how you think AI can solve that problem with a limited data set. Uh, just kind of out of curiosity. And yeah, see you guys next time I think of something. Oh, and P.S. I love how I started doing these videos with like, I'm going to do a field report and it's going to be very neat and organized and they're going to be numbered. And at this point, I have way too many ideas and way too many just things that I want to get out there into the universe that I just make videos. I don't even edit them. They're all one takes. Well, they're not all one takes, but they're all like 
one straight video, no edits, and just publish and upload. So, yeah, there you go.